The death toll in the Tuesday Kampala twin bombings has risen to seven, according to police. Police spokesperson Fred Enanga has told journalists that investigations into the attacks have already commenced and a team of suspects have been arrested from different parts of the country. But some have been killed in the process. Within these few days, we have arrested 21 suspects after dismantling their cells, that is ADF cells in Imperere, Lueza and in Toroko. Amongst these ones, we have operatives, uh, coordinators, and even some of their financiers. We shall avail this list, but of now, of course, so we don't want to alert them. Pictures and names of those arrested have been displayed to journalists with the help of the Army spokesperson, Brigadier Flavia Biekwansu. That is Ragonza, still part of logistics, uh, courier, and still in Toroko Bundibujo. According to Brigadier Biekwansu, these people disguise themselves by putting on losaries, yet they belong to a different religion. Yet another hint at the entrance to belief that terrorists belonging to a specific religion. She's putting on a rosary, they are all putting on a rosary. Therefore, when you see them, these are Catholics. That's why I wanted you to take the, the, that, the names and put the names here. Don't think that this one is for no reason. They have a reason why they have to get a mark. These are the items believed to have been used by these groups to hide the bombs, have also been displayed, which include bags, watches, and so many. Police also confessed to killing suspects responsible for coordinating and recruiting people for radicalization. These include Atindia Yasin, a.k.a. Senawul Yadan, Biaruhanga Musa Bahemuka, Turichimanya Joshua Mathias, and Wagonza Joseph. They were all crossing from Chisege in, in Toroko. Security says 13 other people were anticipated at Karungutu and according to Enanga, these were seven adults and six juveniles who were being smuggled out of the country into DRC Kong. Flavia Ninkuze for CTV PM Edition. Mugamba.